Hey All Blacks fans, it's Lester Fainuka here. Um, join me in the sheds tonight after a famous victory here in South Africa in Alice Park and uh, we'll get in touch with a few of the boys and see how it felt out there, so follow me. Starting off a new new debut for tonight. Oh. New recruit for the family, Fletcher Newell, aka Flex, aka Dogo Filetti. Mate, run us through the whole week, preparations, um, how you feeling and also and what it meant for you? Yeah, I suppose it's been a pretty surreal couple of weeks, list. Uh, yeah, I remember a couple of weeks ago I was just preparing to play Otago for Canterbury and um, got the call from Shani to come over here and it was um, it was pretty surreal for me and my family and yeah, to be, to be named earlier in the week to play um, today and make my debut at Alice Park, it's, yeah, it's been unreal and um, managed to get the old man over so um, yeah, he's pretty in awe at the moment, but um, just real grateful um, to be given this opportunity and um, it was awesome to have my family watching at home and um, yeah, to give it all back to them. Uh, we'll join you with uh, the outstanding Rico Yani tonight. Uh, mate, man, man, man of the match performance. Um, mate, it was awesome watching out there and see you work. Um, what was your face to Sarah inside quite a few times in your career? Um, Tell me how much it meant for you playing out there and also I guess the pressure that comes off to be able to perform and um, obviously play for that Freedom Cup which means so much for not only this nation but ours too. Yeah, I think it's awesome. I think, um, you know, with the struggling weeks that we've had the, the last couple of weeks and, you know, um, it starts to get a bit of noise around the team, you know, we knew as a team that um, if we stuck strong, we, we know how, how good we can be and uh, the heights we can go to and um, this was a glimpse tonight but um, you know there's still room to improve and we'll look to do that next game. 100% mate, it's the same performance and truly proud of you. Congrats mate. Cheers mate. Sammy, uh, one of our most experienced boys in the group, um, obviously faced the sides quite a few times. Um, just give us a rundown on, I guess, what it takes to be able to come over here, over the ditch, um, be able to play against the Foley Springbok side in front of their people, and also, on top of that, the Freedom Cup, which um, means so much to their people, but also ours. Um, tell me what it, what it means, and also what it takes to be able to come over and be able to take that trophy back home. Yeah, it's always uh, a massive occasion, whether we're over here for one week or two. Um, the pressure's always there, and I'm just so proud of the boys, the way they stepped up. We, uh, we knew it was going to be loud here at Alice Park. Um, there's some massive skeletons here as All Blacks. We haven't been that successful here uh, over, over history, but the best thing about tonight is the boys got stuck in early, got in front on the scoreboard, and we just managed to you know, keep chipping away. A great side like they are, they came back, but the best thing is the boys stayed nice and calm. It was loud, so boys were connecting with eyes, body language, and voice. And so good to uh, come over the top of them at the end and get a, a great win. Oh, unreal. Sammy, great efforts out there, and uh, thank you very much. Thanks, bro. That's yeah, so All Black TV uh, family. Thanks for calling me experience, not old, too. So. Yeah, I was going to say old, old, but I knew you'd probably get in one, so experience. Respect the old boys.